Hey, my wax friends. Welcome to my channel. And hey, y'all. Hey, y'all. Girlfriend here in the video. And we're going to do... Uh, you shit. said girlfriend. For the people who don't know that I'm oh, your daughter. Lordy. Yeah. I'm like... Please don't mix up the words. This is my daughter. 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 I'm a daughter. Okay. Daughter. Birth from the... Mo <laughs> Would you get a... <laughs> no, God. I don't need what... From the womb. From the womb. <laughs> I thought you were going to say the most high. Oh, my God. <laughs> Dang. <laughs> yeah. Burn. Yeah, From the most high. I heard it. I heard it. I heard it. This I is vintage. It. Chick <laughs> sense. You can do it. Vintage chick sense. Come on. Woo! Vintage, vintage chick, chick sense. sense. Yeah, this is her <laughs> haul. Okay, I gotta get. I, I, man, it's almost one o'clock in the morning. And I'm up with this, but it's so late. Wax love is being shared right now. So this is order number two and three that has made it here today. Yay for UPS! Uh, P.S. They did a good job. They didn't have to get strangled. P.S. USPS did their they job They didn't get choked today. out. They did a they good job. They didn't get choked out. And I Everything was prepared. arrived safe and sound. Nothing was hurt. Nothing. Let me show you people. This is her business card for those of you who did not see the first video. And I want to personally give a shout out to Kirby's hubby, Mr. Hugh, and her mom, Miss oh. Sandy. That's her name because they help her. Uh, Mr. Hugh did the um, the web site for her, which ran very well. It was very smooth, organized. Um, it's according to scents. So, like, you have fresh and clean, floral, uh, fruity, tropical, and then you have, like, bakery. And when you go to the website there are four different categories and you pick which one is your scent preference or what you're in search of and then beneath once that'll open up a slew of whatever scents are available in that scent and i just want to say you know that's very very good when you can see family pull together work together and make a business work they're helping her her vision um come true so i just wanted to give those two um a shout out her mom helped her with the packing of the boxes and getting things shipped. And that's just really, really sweet because everybody don't have mamas that's going to um, come and take time and help their, their babies out. Can't even be found for that matter. Look, look, okay. this is the moment I take the time to say I'm so happy for you. Ah, because I got waxed today. Uh, I said I'm so happy for you, like you, your body, you, you having oh, you in my life. Come on, man, tighten thank up. Thank you. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah, man. Game moment. Sorry. Okay. Now I have some rolls, trios to show you guys. A couple of clamshells and three bags of scent shots. So I'm gonna jump in here and we're gonna get this show on the roll. Vroom vroom. Let's go. Um, the first one is Holly Go Lightly. Remember, pour dates are on these. And this is what it looks like in the front. Let me I like closer. the variation. I it's do too. It's not all white. It's not all blue. You're getting a little blue, a little white, and a little blue and white. Mama bear, papa pear, baby bear. Papa pear. <laughs> well, pears. Look, anything can happen after one after midnight. Mama bear, papa pear, and baby something. Yes. It's and this is the beautiful rose, and it cute y'all. One ounce is detailed. the wax, um, quite weight. nicely sized. It ain't puny. Ooh, Holly. Now, Holly is from a movie that I own. Told you I own a lot of these that she did, which is Breakfast and Tiffany. What happened in that scene when she goes a little bonkers and starts messing up the room and the feathers is everywhere from the blankets and don't look at me. The, I, you bought me that really big, beautiful um, canvas yeah, photo yeah, from Breakfast and I, I, all I know is I supported the photo, not the movie. You don't know. I mean, I did I, exactly. That's yeah, what I'm saying. Like I didn't watch movie. the movie. I didn't watch it. I cheated. I got mm. the picture. This is very nice. The, Scent descriptions will be below because below. I'm not the best scent 
describer. I try my best. Some days I be, you know, cutting up. And other days I be missing it. But it smells very nice. And I think I have the next one. Similar color. And this is in White Christmas. And you'll find White Christmas under the uh, Clean Sense, if I'm not mistaken. White Christmas is another movie that's one of our, my favorites with Bing Crosby. Mm -hmm. Was it um, Dana? Dana Shore? No, I don't think she's in that one. But anyways, they go to this resort. Well, like this ski lodge and it's I won't tell you the movie but it's a nice Christmas one. I don't Yeah it smells like Christmas. It smells nice. It's like Christy vanilla Boss. Vanilla and something in here. Like a mint. I put that but in whatever the mint jar. is in here is not like uh, it's it's muted. Okay, let me keep going. Please focus, young lady. Huh? This is Film Nora. Hello, Fumbelina. And this is the the pattern, the shindig. Well, they're all roses as far as her actual shapes. And she has her scent shots. And then she has her clamshells. These retail for three twenty-five or so. Have a receipt somewhere, and I got the um doilies for each of my orders too. By the way, so just in case anyone is wondering, um, this is repeated. Now, I will say, um, I'm 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 not a what uh. A business owner as far as wax is concerned but I was thinking today on the shipping like each box ship shipped individually and they could have fit in a medium or a large flat rate box had she did that the difference of the eight and eight sixteen dollars actually could have went well if she went with a large then it would have been a little bit more but whatever the difference was if it was refunded most people would have turned around and just went back online and spent more money but when you start losing it in shipping then it affects how much you're able to actually buy but I'm sure she will work that out I'm, I'm telling you I will not be surprised if that's available later on down the line this one is film your and this one smells really good too Ooh, oh, this smells very good. I like this. Oh, this the the scent. I honestly I have was. not come across one that I do not like. Oh, I like. And I normally have one or two that. It's not like I'm looking for a bad apple. It's no. just you know you naturally it, mentally it, expect it, a bad apple, and it's kind of shocking when you don't even. Well, no, get, I wasn't expecting. Not really expecting, but bad. It's just it's. You it's, kind of prepare yourself just in case. No. It's I just did. sometimes when I get warmers, I mean, when I get wax orders that they, um, you know, give you a freebie or you're trying a new scent and it's with the ones you, you know, you, you buy from all the time. But when they come up with a new scent, sometimes you think you'll like it. But you don't, or they sing your free sample, and you don't. Yeah. So far, based on everything that I have smelled or sniffed from this company, I have not found come across one that is just I can't do it, even if it fell in a category that I don't normally shop in. Film nor scent description will be below. Film nor because right now I'm just like yes I love it. Can out of the whole order I'm gonna be honest. Film nor is number one for me. Yeah. Number uno. And I like them all. I like. Um, I'm a mood melter. Um, I don't do the seasonal thing, but I melt based on how I feel, what's going on in my house, what kind of my attitude. So my wax has personality in my home. 
and white christmas is definitely one that i would melt on a chill day getting ready to watch a classic movie or a romantic comedy mm -hmm. um white christmas is one that i would melt to be honest even on the first time that you let have a first date company you know when you normally go out and meet up somewhere but this is the first time you letting that person in your home this one is a nice one because it doesn't give the impression that you're fixing to get busy with anybody mm -hmm. it's i'm comfortable with you enough that i'm letting you come by my house and we're going to sit and we're going to really watch a movie and not be a movie but um yeah that's what i'm talking about norma jean norma jean i believe is in the tropical or bakery norma jean let me show you isn't it cute um i don't know what to say again on the i like it it's got a nice it's good. It's got a nice Sweet. Blend. Let me show you the actual. The rose is very pretty. Nice. You do need to leave that device alone. Um, the next one is um another Holly Go Lightly. And this was poured on December the 13th. So, you know, if I wanted to just buck the system and melt on, I could. But again, this is a very brand new vendor. New to me. Her wax performance. So I yeah. want to give this every possible opportunity. opportunity to ball and shine in my warmer. I don't want it to be, oh, I you melted it um a week or so early. So it looks like I got two film. Nor, hold on, you guys. Let me get this together over here. I do. So I got two film nor, and I have two Holly Go Lightly, one White Christmas. Yeah, here's the other Holly Go Lightly. So there's a few duplicates, and um. A Norma Jean and then you saw the ones from yesterday so um hi <laughs> and now this is gentlemen prefer blondes oh really nah. yeah Marilyn Monroe gentlemen prefer anybody that's sweet some of them. Ain't it, fellas? Don't lie to me. Us. Well, some like raging lunatics, but hey, that's personal preference. <laughs> I like it. It's really nice. This is, um... <laughs> yeah, I just realized I haven't even smelled this. She done took it, sat on her lap. I want to show it. This smells very good, honey. This smells very good. You need to do something about that. Yeah, it's shedding everywhere. I'm so sorry. Dang. So, let me go ahead and move on. I got this. 360. Okay. Ta-ta. That's really good. That is very nice. Um, okay, clamshells. This one is one that Miss Tiffany Garcia from Tiffany Candles made. And I know it's got Fruit Loops. And I want to say pomegranate and marshmallow. But it's Fruit Loops and I think pomegranate or watermelon and something else. And this is War of the Worlds. Let me get up here. War of the Worlds. Mm -hmm. And this was actually, now this one, I would feel comfortable melting. This one was November the 27th. Look how, look how long you was in the kitchen. Cooking and baking on us and ain't even say nothing. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. And many months before that, I'm sure. I'm pretty sure. This smells very nice. I pick up on the Fruit Loop. And an interesting thing about Kirby's Fruit Loop that I haven't smelled in quite some time is the actual cereal note from Fruit Loop is in this. So she got a true 
Fruit Loop. It's not Fruit Loop, seeing you wondering well, why is it called Princess Fruit of Loop. Monaco. Grace Kelly. Oh boy. This smells so, so nice. Let me show you the wax detail. Hey, another disco ball. Those are, um, no, this one is a little different. This is more like a gem. And look at the sprinkles. Now, these are little micro beads on here. This is a very good lemon. Mm -mm -mm. Uh -uh. It's very nice and creamy. And this is uh, lemon and marshmallow. Noel. Something like that. I would but, say it's a little vanilla in there. Okay, I already broke broke into one of the, the bags. They all come like this. But I didn't smell without you. I could not leave you guys out of this. So the first one we have here is Jackson. Jackson is based off. Now look if I can remember like what it's based off of, but can't hardly remember the scent descriptions. I'm it's sorry. okay. Um Jackson, Jackson is familiar. blueberry cobbler. I can remember that. Jackson is one of my uh I like country music too, y'all. Um, and this is let me get it together. I got this one. Um June Carter Cash. And Johnny Cash. Mm -hmm. Give me a minute. I can get it together. I don't care what time of the night it is. And this is one of their country duets. And this is Blueberry Cobbler. I like Johnny Cash. I love a good bit of his uh, music. And I like a lot that him and June did together. Their, their relationship is very, very um, interesting. And ain't this something how he passed away just a few months after she did? That's when you know it's real. It's spirit, they're spiritually connected when one go um, after the other one. Um, this, look how naturally I'm the um, mm -hmm. wax has the um, cup info in it. But anyhow, this is two toned and the sprinkles on top. It's very nice. Been hard headed on camera. Mm hmm. And this is a mild blueberry. I like your blueberry, Kirby, because me and blueberry, we're still courting. And I don't always like most blueberries. I put up with some. I try to make myself like some, but I don't normally order it. This is a nice blueberry. This was almost a blueberry. This was good. Are you thinking about any inputs on Jackson? None? Jackson is just an interesting name. Yeah, I like it. I love it. And this one is Gilligan's Island. And this was poured in November too. So it's the few that I actually can get down with. This is, me and my words, this is November 23rd. And Gilligan's Island was... You know it's the TV show. Here it goes. And let me tell you. Quick trivia. I, trivia. I love tr movie trivia. Um, Ginger. It's actually, because I own a lot of Dallas um, DVDs, the seasons. And Ginger is actually, oh, I don't know the name is Tina. But she's um, JR's mistress that he didn't marry and he put Sue Ellen before her. That's her in the first season and I think she comes back in season two. And then she's also in the Stanford Wives. Holla. Yeah, look at that. FYI. Click and this trivia. is um Palm Beach Cooler and Bahama Fizz, I think, mixed together. It's a Palm Beach Cooler, Bahama Fizz and something. Shout out to Palm Beach. This smells very good, you guys. Again, everything is just beautiful. Did I let you smell that one, babes? Was that Jackson? No, Gilligan's Island. No, I didn't smell it. Oh, I'm that sorry. One. I don't want to leave you out. Here you go. Thank you. So while I talk about this one, this is Imogene Serendipity Cream Pie, which is after Kirby's grandma. This is and this is a serendipity cream pie. But I think it's got a, another note. I don't know if it's marshmallow or coconut in it. 
description notes will be at the bottom. Look at the little mini um, beads on this one. And I was afraid of this one, to be honest with you. Because some serendipities can be very um, pungent, very strong, very in your face, and too much uh, cherry. And I was a little concerned about that. But again, I just trusted that Kirby don't norm is sensitive to headaches. I love this and stuff. So she probably wasn't. A, she wants a strong scent throw, but she We're don't want one. Strong. Yeah, overly well, overwhelmingly strong. This one is very good. Mm -hmm. So I'll be ordering more. And I got scent shots and ones that I wasn't for sure about. And I got a couple of extra for one, if any I wanted to share. I could. And this is just a duplicate. This is another Gil Gilligan's Island. So let's move on. When I hear Gilligan's Island, it makes me think of the old Nickelodeon show. This is what's remaining. So you guys don't think you'll be here for forever and ever and ever with me. And we got two freebies. And it's in... One is in Rosemary Baby again. Which is lavender mint. I found out what that was. And I don't know why I couldn't get it together last night, but uh, the other night. And this is Grandma's Pearls. So let me smell Grandma's Pearls. And this is another story about her grandma. This one smells like Fabuloso. Uh, mm -hmm. Um. Mm. It smells good. Would you We're trying to this figure is, it out. Is this floral or clean? Clean. No, I like floral. It's like warring with each other. Floral. This like this is a walk in the garden. This is nice. Flower patch. This is one that you melt in your bathroom when you have candles burning around the bathtub yeah. with a bubble bath and rose petals in the water. Hey. Put grandma pearls in. Hey, you only live once, folks. YOLO. Okay, now, this one is Betty Crocker, which puts a smile on my face. This is apple pie. Listen to your girl. Growth. Apple pie and uh, zucchini bread is what's in this one. And then I have another one. So I have three so far of Betty Crocker. And this is Flapper Girl. Hey. And this is one of the admin's um, creations. I can't think of if, if it was Miss Carrie or Gina. But it's one of the admin's. Um, girl, you go, girl. Well, you look, look like you did your thing. Wow. Oh, she did a thing. Oh yeah, good. she's got she's got one of my favorite smells, and it smells like candy, kind of. I can't tell you right now. I'm off the top of my head what Flapper Girl mix is, but it will be in the description box below. Mm -hmm. You can count on that. And Kirby will be releasing um tomorrow her upcoming restocks, and I'm already like, cause I want some stuff. This is Elvis in Hawaii. My great grandmother was a big Elvis fan. <laughs> she loved herself some Elvis and Tom Jones. I'm telling you, y'all, I am just a composite of all things nice. Um, Elvis in Hawaii, when you agree when you hear, um, was poured on 1212. <laughs> and he's. He is trying to pop him out. Come on. You can do it. I like him. I, I, I this just... one I think is the Palm Beach Cooler and the Bahama Fizz. Yeah. And then Gilligan is Bahama Fizz or Palm Beach Cooler. It's one of the two and something else. I don't know. I like it. I'm trying to figure that one out. Let me go on. This is another Elvis. 
the golden age hey. of Hollywood. The best age in film history. Okay. That had, had that little make me think. Me. The Roaring Twenties. Mm-mm-mm. That's definitely bakery, without yeah. a shadow of a doubt. Bakery, and it looked like it's living up to its name. Mm-hmm. It's interesting. That's good. Interesting. Very That's good. Interesting. I you know like what you're it. finna get? Two thumbs up. That's very good. Seriously. Um, I want to say it's got some kind of sugar cookie. But I'm going to refrain from scent description because I'm going to put it in the description bar below. We're going to keep calm. And then anything that you saw in this video and you're wondering what does it smell like, just check the box below and it will be there. Kirby, you did a very good job. I like this. We are in our last bag. I think I all think together too fast. with the shipping I mean, was 83 bucks. We go through her, her scents and stuff too fast. I'd be kind of like, dude, there's no more. Oh. Well, I think if I didn't worry about time, I would just sit with this for way longer. Um, I really do like the Golden Age. I like Gilligan's Island a lot. I just got I so many. I love Flapper Girl. I got Flapper Girl is a yes. beast. Um, Princess of Monaco. I mean, these are great. Serendipity cream pies. No, no, I wouldn't tell you I did if I didn't. These are some very no. good ones. If we don't we like it, we'll say so. Mm -hmm. Two more samples. And Rosemary Baby, I think it's just <laughs> Kirby. What's up with you and Rosemary Baby? You know, uh, uh, Roland Pul Polanski. What's his name? What's up with that? You like that movie, don't you, girl? It's your favorite. I think so. And this is my favorite thing. I think this is one. Uh, on this movie, too. Sound of Music. And just sometimes I have to have myself tuned up for that movie. And be she sang a, too much. It's a lot of singing. I love the movie. It's a bloody classic. But, ooh. It's a good... I mean, I'm sorry. I had to say it. It's a good movie. And I like about the Von Trapps who were real people, you know, but the story had to be fantasized some. But, um, yeah, I like the Von Trapps, but it is a movie that I have to get tuned up for because of the, the only one I fast for it is the I am 16 going on. Why? That's my, that's my thing. She loves it. And it was my theme song from when I was really, I am 16 going on Okay, 17. we got to just... That was really my I theme I think what song. I'm going to start doing is doing movie reviews because I like movies. Yeah. I love movies and television. I I own way yeah, too many. I need a cabinet for it. But let me tell you, because you, you're like, Aisha, I could give two farts less about the movie. Can oh, you please know, tell me? It what my favorite things smell like. Well, wait, if you got an idea of the movie, then you'll kind of understand the scent. Kirby didn't just name these after, you know, that movie for no reason. That's true. Word. Word up. Um, that's a very nice, beautiful <laughs> analogy. Oh, my God. <laughs> I have smart children. Uh, yeah. There's a reason why she picked these particular movies, titles, quotes, and names and connected them with these these scents. So, I touch and agree with that. Um, this definitely smells like bakery to me. Almost like a zucchini bread. It smells like all my favorite things. This is another Jackson. I'm going to keep it moving. I another like Gilligan's it. Island. Good, because I like a Gilligan's Island. Tell me this another flapper girl. No. Did we get lucky? No. This is my favorite thing, so I actually bought myself one. When the dog bites, when the bee sings. Did he sing or he sting? He stung. <laughs> it's, 
It's a bad day when the dog bites. Oh, when the bee stings. Oh, when I'm feeling sad. sad. I simply remember my favorite things. And then I will feel so bad. Yeah, man. Yeah. World's Fair of 1939. No, I wasn't trying to say that at that moment. I, I definitely wasn't. I was going to say that and I was like, them people don't care. Uh, no, I was not trying to say no. Um, World's Fair. World's Fair is caramel popcorn. I'm holding on to favorite things I think for it's, some reason. Now, this is what I be talking about, and I preach about this all the time. Uh-oh. One vendor don't get it right. No. Next, and I'm not saying that it's something with their formula. It's I know that they buy different oils, and oh, they okay. all buy their wax from different people. So it could just be clearly be their their particular oil man ain't the right man for a certain scent. Kettle corn, corn, popcorn, corn, popcorn, the pop pop, all week free samples and stuff and I'm just not digging it. Get to this. This is a caramel popcorn if I'm not mistaken and she didn't overwhelm me with the popcorn. Is that a popcorn? I like it. Well, yeah. Now yeah. Um, the caramel I would have loved to smell a little bit more. A little yeah, bit more of that caramel and a little more sugar yeah. glaze because you know caramel is laid poured thick and it's it's a sugar uh, glazed type, so you want to have a good heaping of it over the popcorn. It's sugar, ultimately. So, yeah. Look at me. I want to say condensed chef, yeah, but I like this. I'm glad I was debating about, well, I don't know, because I don't really have nothing in the popcorn. Jackie O. Wow, well, I don't got a Jackie O. 3. Roses. It's in my wish list. This is Jackie Onassis, people. Jacqueline Bouvier. Something like that. Bouvier. Kennedy. And uh, trying to get this out. Look at the multicolor beads on a white wax. Smells good. It smells like. It I promise you, my next order for her restock that's coming up. What I will do, pardon me for that, because I know that's bad etiquette to scratch your hand public. But um, what I'll do is copy the scent list, print it out on a piece of paper. And so when I go through this, because I get happy and excited and all, I get dumb. Um, <laughs> have the set descriptions directly in front of me and that's what I'm gonna yeah, do you know I, I was gonna do it tonight but it's almost two in the morning and I that's didn't genius. do it um but that's what I'll do from here on out so that way as we go through it when I'm crazy and acting deranged then I'll at least be able to follow the the set descriptions on paper mm -hmm. and this is just another Jackie O so this is my complete order I got a lot of uh, scent shots, some clamshells, and the trios. I think next time when I go in, I'll get mostly clamshells. But some of those um, roses just really pulls you in because they're so feminine and so pretty and sophisticated. They're eloquent. 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 And uh, I'm happy. I'm happy with everything. The only one that I probably wouldn't like go out my way to buy is probably Elvis. Because it's a note in there that I know that's not right up. That's not up my scent alley. But it's not bad where I would still melt it. I don't think I'm going to even show Elvis. Not even mm -mm. Elvis. Um, thanks guys for tuning in. 34 minutes and 22 seconds. We appreciate your time. We appreciate all the positive comments that was left on the first video, oh, yeah. all the positive comments that were left in the group, I had to back away from the comments for a minute because um, I got a little emotional. emotional. Yeah. yeah. And it's nice to see camaraderie 
in the wax community it's good to see you all of us come together again and be excited and get along get along and be excited for um our girl you know kirby and just our love for wax and good Absolutely. wax quality good quality wax made you know handmade products um so i just wanted to say at the end of the video for those who stuck around yeah. to the end is that i really do appreciate you guys very much mm -hmm. and i appreciate everybody who sits through these kind of videos because yeah. it's hard for me especially if it's like this is zucchini bread i hate that. I, I it's very Why? hard for me Why do the videos? to You're gonna do that. sit through a lengthy video so i appreciate all of you who pause me come back to me stick yeah. with me from beginning to end whatever. listen to us on your way to work, work. oh my getting God. ready for your i appreciate you i really do um and we're gonna make 2014 great we're gonna rock mm -hmm. this year you feel me last year was for the birds this year is for the winners ain't it now